New at three, there are a lot of ways to remember a lost loved one, but a seamstress right here in Tampa has come up with a unique idea that's positively Tampa Bay. She is sewing their favorite clothes into a keepsake teddy bear. ABC Action News reporter Robert Boyd shows us how every stitch is made with love. Inside So So Amazing Alterations, owner Jade Sanchez has stitched everything from sweaters to pants to ball gowns. But 2022 is becoming the year of the memory bear. What's so heartfelt is that the materials used to make these bears are some of the, the favorite shirts and pants that your loved one wore, right? Absolutely. It's a great way to put them to use, definitely. Even if you only have one shirt, like the lady, uh, she came yesterday, Yvette, she has one shirt of her father, and she wanted me to, to use that. She said, is that enough? Of course it's enough. The first memory bear Jade created was for the family of her own boyfriend, Sherrod Hunter, who died suddenly of a heart attack. The belly of this bear right here, right here. this was your brother's favorite pair of shorts. Yes, they were. he literally wore them all the time. Now, mind you, he had clothes for days, but whenever you saw him, he had these shorts on. We cried because, you know, it was very emotional, but right after the tears came the laughter. Jade embroiders a special message to the families on the tummy of every bear. These are clothes I used to wear. Whenever you hold it, know that I am there. Love, Sherrod. When someone passes suddenly, you really don't have the time to say goodbye. But this right here, this is our goodbye. This is our goodbye from Rod. Jade is just so glad she can use her talents to create something that's so positively Tampa Bay. She's already made 25 bears in the past month, and they are all one of a kind. My motto is every stitch is made with love. Uh, I love what I do. I keep it in my car, in my room, in the living room. Um, he travels with me. What would Sherrod say looking down at this bear with those shorts? He would say, no, she didn't. <laughs> no, she didn't. Cut up my shorts. <laughs> in Tampa, Robert Boyd, ABC Action News.